Hello everyone. Today we are going to talk about power supplies, specifically the power supplies that we carry here from Godlike. They're called the Power All. Um, you can buy it in many different ways, a couple different kit choices. We're going to talk about some of the cables that come in it and some of the uses for those cables in today's episode. All right, let's do it. Where we're going to start is the Power All kit comes with the Power All power supply. This is a single outlet power supply and basically what it'll do is you can power one pedal off it if you want or you can use the power supply. You can hook it into this daisy chain right here and then with the deluxe kit you're going to have 11 kind of extensions of that. Now this thing has a 2000 milliamp draw at 9 volts regulated so you're going to want to try and figure out how much power draw your pedals are pulling. And that'll kind of give you an idea of how many pedals you can power off of this single power all. So once you figure out which pedals that you want to put on your board, uh, all of these extension cables will come in handy. For instance, this here is just an extension cable. This will extend off of one of the existing plugs on your daisy chain. And this one's good you know, if you need that extra room, you could plug this directly into your pedal. That's fine. But this is good if you have like a big kind of awkward pedal and you need the, the kind of reach around length. Next on the list, this cable is for pedals, you know, that you may have that you want to power off of the power all on your pedal board, but don't actually have a, a DC jack. Uh, this happens actually all the time. I have an old fuzz face and that fuzz face does not have a power jack. So what this does is this hooks up to your 9 volt battery clip and then it plugs right in. And then you can power your, you know, old fuzz face with the power all. Moving on. This one's good. This is the, you know, eighth inch, you know, jack that you see on a lot of older pedals. A lot of old DODs, uh, a lot of Electro Harmonix. It, basically, this will help convert your standard power coming out of the Power All so you can use it on your vintage Big Muff. Next on the list is this cable. This red cable is for basically reverse polarity situation. You know, a lot of pedals that are based on old designs like a tone bender, they actually have a positive ground rather than a negative ground. This cable will allow you to power those pedals off of the power all. And last in the cable category, but certainly not least, are these two cables. These here are designed to be used with, you know, your line six modelers. They use a 2.5 millimeter jack. It's a little different. It's also a reverse polarity. So these are good to have if you have like one of those um, line six delays or something like that and you want to power it off the power all, you'd use these cables. Same as the other ones, hooks right up to this. This will hook right into your line six pedal. These are available in the kit with a right angle and straight depending on what you need. The last thing that we have here are these little sheets. The deluxe kit comes with five of these. These are good because you can put them on anything you're not using at the time to protect it so you don't get any kind of, you know, little nasty spark or anything. So if you have unused plugs on the power all, say you got 11 of these, you filled it up with six different pedals, you want to put these on the remaining you know, plugs just like this. Good to go. So we showed you what came in the deluxe kit. Now we also have the basic kit. It's a little bit smaller. It's going to come with very similar stuff. It's going to come with your power all and instead of an 11 uh, plug daisy chain, it's going to come with a five plug daisy chain. And then it'll come with a few less options in the way of the extension cables. But that's okay. If you have a smaller pedal board and you don't want the 11 plug daisy chain, you can get this basic kit. It'll get you where you want to go. And anything you need to hook up your pedals can all be bought separately on our site. So we have these cables available 
for single purchase. So you can customize your board however you want to. The Deluxe will take care of it a lot, especially if you have a big board, you know, something like you're in a shoegaze band and you're doing nothing but My Bloody Valentine covers. Um, maybe you want this one. But if you're in a much smaller band with a pared down board, then you can use the basic. And you can always customize it from there. So that's it for today. We went over some of the power supplies, how they work, what the cables do. And with that information, you should be able to kind of move on and figure out how to wire up your pedal board yourself. You can also check out more info on our website. There'll be links for all of these items, the kits, the power supply, and all the individual cables below the video you're watching. You can subscribe to our channel because we're always going to be uploading new stuff, um, tech tips, product highlights, new products coming in. And you can also check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and Tumblr because we're always going to be letting people know when we put new videos up. All right. Thanks a lot.